Chinwen Zhang versus Donna Vekic is the final and gold medal match for the Olympics for 2024. And both ladies have had great roads to get to this stage. Vekic into the tournament as the number 13 seed and will take on Bronzetti in the first round. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-2-7-5. In the second round, she's taken on Andrescu. But again, no problems getting through in straights. 6-3-6-4. In the third round, she's taken on Coco Goff, the number two seed. And this is a battle. After coming back in the first set, she'd eventually win in straights. 7-6-6-2. In the quarterfinals, she'd take on Kostruk, the number 12 seed, who had just beaten Sakari in the previous round. And this was another battle. After saving multiple match points in the final set tiebreak, she'd eventually get through in three, six, four, two, six, seven, six, to advance to the semifinals. In the semifinals, she'd take on Schmidlova, who'd taken out Krajikova along the way. This is no problem getting through in straights. Six, four, six, love to get to the gold medal match. Zhang entered the tournament as the number six seed and would take on Arani in the first round. This is no problem getting through in straights. Six, love, six, love. In the second round, she'd take on Rus, and again, no problem getting through in straights. 6 2 6 4. In the third round, she'd take on Navarro, the number 11 seed. And this was a battle. After saving match points, she'd fight back to win 6 7 7 6 6 1. In the quarterfinals, she'd take on Kerber, who's playing her final tournament in her professional career. And this was another battle. After going down a set, she'd fight back to win and save multiple match points 6 7 6 4 7 6 to advance to the semifinals. In the semifinals, Zhang would take on Sviantek, the world number one, who she'd never beaten in six previous meetings. And after winning the first set, she'd fight back to win the second 6 2 7 5. To advance to the final and the gold medal. These two were played twice before with the head dead split down the middle 1-1. Their previous meeting, however, was last year in China with Zhang getting the win in a close three setter. But of course, this is on clay. So it'll be interesting to see who can take the advantage on the red stuff. If Vekic is going to win this one, she can just settle the nerves and play aggressive like she did against Schmidlova. She was so impressive in that match. And also, she was so impressive in the golf match as well in that third round. So if she can use both of those confident boosting matches to get the win here, she should. Also needs to limit those errors as well and try to keep the nerves because that's always what gets her. It's what got her at Wimbledon. If Zhang's going to win this one, she needs to be confident like she was against Fiontech. She looked so rock solid in that match. Even when she was losing, she looked rock solid. Now, Fiontech did give away a lot of errors, but, but Zhang didn't do that. So she needs to stay solid and serve big because that serve is the key. Such a great final. Zhang's been in great form this year. So is Vekic. So it's a fitting final for the gold medal. But I've got to go with Zhang in this one. I feel like when she plays for China, it's just different. And she looks so, so good this week. Beating Sviantec, getting the gold. I reckon she gets this one done in three sets. But let me know who's winning the gold medal.